Thank you, Maria, for reminding us who we fight for and why we are here today. Today, we join a growing chorus of voices calling on President Biden to exercise on one of the most profound powers of the presidential office, the power of clemency. Clemency represents a critical opportunity to correct a long-standing injustices, recognize human potential for redemption, and acknowledge that our legal system has often been more punitive than restorative. The United States represents just 5% of the world's population, yet we hold more than 20% of the global prison population. Over 1.9 million individuals are currently incarcerated with a disproportionate impact on communities of color. Black men are incarcerated at more than five times the rate of white men, a legacy of systematic inequalities that have persisted for generations. Recent reforms like the First Step Act have begun to address some of these inequalities, but they are not enough. Clemency offers a direct path to immediate relief for people who have, been, who have demonstrated rehabilitation, who have developed job skills, pursued education, and shown remarkable personal growth despite challenging circumstances. This moment calls for a moral courage. This calls for recognizing that true justice is not just about punishment, but about giving people meaningful opportunities to contribute to their communities. President Biden has a real opportunity to make a difference. In these final days of his term, we are calling on him to act. Let's give people a second chance. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah.